Yes, today's white days. So, who else did you promote at that point? At that uh, level, at that I level. promoted Metallica, Rihanna, Beyonce, Lady Gaga. I'm talking about studying low acts, Iron Maiden. Yeah, if we go one level down, you know, like Pearl Jam, Amy Winehouse. And, you know, just to... You Bob Dylan, you know, so many. The idea of the session is to look at information that is freely available to you as artists or managers, how to distill that information and, and actually put it to practical use. Um, we're joined by Gabriel from Music Blue and Tony from Mimi Bands. So I'm joined by an illustrious panel of, of experts in the topic. As a new artist, it's very good to make sure you've got as many ducks in a row. You very much have to be the master of your own destiny, so give us as many reasons as possible to want to get involved in your business. Ultimately, the greatest artists will always have their own vision. It's just sometimes a case of really just pulling it out of them um, and, and being like, okay, so what do you need in facilitating that? It's about making a band into a lifestyle brand, not just, not just musicians, it's like actually an, an entity. Yeah. And the way that we try and work with gigs now as well, and so we do gigs as events. And the reason we sign bands is because we think there's something there and we can say whatever we want about producers, collaboration and everything. But if we believe in the band, we sign you. We don't sign you because we can put you with X, Y or Z. Mm. We sign you because we see something in you. I, I knew we should have allocated way more time for this panel. <laughs> We've overrun by five minutes. We're going to continue the conversation in the bar. So please do come up, ask questions afterwards uh, and uh, Join me in thanking the panel for their... So yeah, today was White Days, that's what happened. And now it's time to go and play a gig. Akeli, a wedding. <laughs>